Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dan, and in this video we're going to be building a miniature picnic table for our chickens. I thought this would be a fun little project we could do to use up some of the offcuts and other leftover material from building our chicken coop. To get started, I've squared up the end of these 2x4 pieces, and I'll cut them to length at 18 inches for the tabletop. Next, I'll trim a couple of 2x3 pieces to 7 and a quarter inches, and then I'm going to cut a 45 degree angle on each lower end to give it some visual appeal. I put a pencil mark on the miter saw fence so that I can quickly align and cut the same amount off each one. Now moving on to the table legs, I'll cut two to length, and then I'll use one of those to set up the cut for the other two. These are 11 and a half inches long. I'm cutting a 30 degree angle on the bottom of each leg, again using a pencil mark on the fence to quickly line up the next cut. I'll make a 30 degree cut on the top of each leg as well, but I'm not going all the way across on this one. And finally I'll trim just a little bit off the top front of each leg. As you can see here, this is needed so that the legs will fit together. This next piece will be for the seat supports. I cut this at 19 and 3 8 inches. And finally, the last cuts at the miter saw are the two seats. These are the same length as the tabletop at 18 inches each. A quick jump over to the table saw to split the seat support into two pieces, so that I'll have one for each side. For assembly, I hit everything with an 80 grit disc on the sander just to knock off the sharp edges and anything that looked like it could cause a splinter. Assembly here is pretty straightforward. I'm not bothering with any glue, just pre-drill and drive some 3 inch screws. 2 and a half inch screws would also be fine, but these are left over from the coop. So I'm just going to use what I have. I'll attach the seat supports next. The top of these supports are four and three quarter inches from the bottom of the leg. and now the two seats get attached. I put one screw in each end and then adjusted everything square before adding the second screw that will lock things in place. I'll finish assembly by adding the two top pieces. The last thing to do is to cut the hole for the snack bowl. I marked the outer edge of the bowl and then made a number of marks about 3 16ths of an inch in from that line. This doesn't have to be perfect, so I'm just freehanding the inner circle. I'll cut the hole using a jigsaw and then use some 80 grit paper to smooth the rough edges. And there we go, it's all set. Now let's take it out and see what the chickens think. They were a little hesitant at first, but I dropped some of our table scraps in the bowl and they were all over it.
Now while we enjoy watching these goofballs and their bad table manners, go ahead and hit that like button and make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Your support is greatly appreciated. Let me know what you think down in the comments, and we'll see you on the next project.